Hello friends, welcome to Amit Things. In this video, we will learn how to install Python on Windows 10. So Python came with the version 3.8.2 on February 24, 2020. So here we will see how to easily install it. So firstly, go to python.org. Here we have reached the home page. Now we will click on latest download Python 3.8.2. Why I'm doing this just to show you that from where you can get the Python versions for different operating systems. Now here you can see for Mac and Windows, the installation is visible. Perhaps the download files are visible, installer or web-based installer. So right now we are on Windows 10 64-bit operating system and we want an installer, an exe file executable. So just click on this, which is x86-64, 64 64-bit OS. So I'll click on it. Now the download should begin. This x86, only x86 is for 32-bit OS. Nowadays we only have 64-bit OS. The new technology is for 64 bit OS, so we are installing this. We will just wait for the installer to download. Now you can see the download has been completed. So now we will go to show in folder. Now you can see the file is visible. We will double click on it. So through this, we will install 3.8.21 Windows 10 operating system. So the installer is visible. Here we can install it in the default path. But to avoid any kind of problem or for simplicity, we will go for customized installation. But before that, we will also set the Python 3.82 path. If you know Java, you have installed Java, you need, you can see we need to manually do it use under the environment variables. So this is quite easier than installing Java. So I will set add Python 3.82 path and we will click on customize installation to give it a new path. Click on it. On clicking, you can see the options are visible. I'll just go to next. The package mostly used for Python is pip, so it will automatically install it as well. I'll, now I'll click on, now I've clicked on next. Here you can see the custom install location is visible, which I don't want. I'll be going to my own location. So I'll click on browse. On clicking browse, I have gone to C drive now under program files. I'll be going to the program files folder and press ok under that i'll set a folder let's set it c drive program files i'll set continue as i am the admin so i'll i'll create a folder python double click on it now in that i'll be setting so i'll set browse again Python and click on OK. Now the path is visible. Now you can check all other files. It will install for all users. In this system, I am, on, I am the only user, which is the admin, Amit. And rest keep as it is and I'll click on install. Now the installation begins. Till then, I'll let the steps here. Python.org, download x86 64 that is 64 bit for windows 64 bit os which is right now for windows 10 after downloading installation begins by double clicking on the exe file while installation set path by just checking a checkbox and set custom path also according to your choice we have set the path as here you can see the installation has been finished so i'll just paste it here the path now let's see what has happened here so the installation is going on here you can see the pip is also installing which is the package for python a well-known package now the installation setup is successful we'll click on close now go to start and type python let's see what has come for us this is the 
app we have installed the manuals the exe file and the module dogs with that we can also see the id so let's just go to command prompt and see that can we easily work with python or not because we have set the path by default while installing in the first step if you remember we have set the path as well so here you can see we set the path by just checking by just checking the checkbox now i'll go to cmd right click run as administrator yes now i'll just type path python as you can see python 3.8.2 successfully installed because we by default set the path in java we need to manually set the path but in this we just check the checkbox and the path was set in the environment variables now i'll write, try to print something so here i'll type the channel name and let's see what happens press enter now you can see amit thinks is visible you can type quit here and the parenthesis to quit okay so that's fine now we can we will work around the id go to start type python and the id le is visible click on it now you can see the id is visible you can also run it here so i'll do the same thing printing print i mean things right let's write some demo text Amit thinks my channel. Now I'll press enter. Let's see what happens. Here you can see the text is visible. So in this video, we saw how to install. Firstly, download Python 3.8.2, the current version. Then we installed it. Then we have set the path by just clicking the checkbox. If you remember, the easiest step, better than Java. Then we have set the custom path, and the Python got installed in the location program files Python. With that. We have also seen how to run Python on command prompt, so that is easier for you to run Python on your system. With that, we also saw how to run Python on ID. Thank you for watching the video. Hope you liked it. For more such videos on programming, free videos on on programming, perhaps just subscribe to Amit Thinks YouTube channel. Keep learning.